Okay, hi, this is Mike Heydrich. I'm gonna show my 20 horsepower rotary phase converter setup, uh, starting up uh, and powering up a um, three phase lug only panel. So, this is my lug only panel. Um, this is my capacitor box um, that I'm gonna use to start the uh, motor, three phase motor. And this right here is a contactor box with some relays in it that will be used to switch the rotary phase converter on and off uh, through a series of momentary push buttons throughout the shop. Um, and then here's my single phase panel uh, with the uh, rotary phase converter um, circuit breaker there that's single phase. Okay. So I'm going to try to hold the phone here. You can watch the uh, contactor. Well, actually, we'll watch the um, contactor that's inside the capacitor box. Um, we have a uh, uh, voltage sensing relay at the top that once the motor is started, um, it will take the start capacitors, which are these capacitors here, out of the circuit, and then these capacitors here will continue to run um, and uh, levelize the voltages. So I'll try to hold this here while I flip the circuit breaker on. You should see it suck in for a few seconds, the motor will start, um, and then it will pop back out. Yep. Just like that, just takes a few seconds. And this is a uh, purpose made 20 horsepower motor just for a rotary phase. There's no uh, shaft on the end. So you heard the uh, contactor that was, that's the switch contactor for control, um, as well as the voltage sensing relay. Uh, drop out of the, the circuit there. That's when everything's open and it shuts everything down. Okay, this is Mikey. Have a good night. Thanks.